What is up everybody? This is Ambulance Boy and today I have a cool little review for you guys. So this is an interesting instrument. Uh, I never did a video about this before but I decided to since I was watching all these videos about weird instruments and I said you know what? Why not make a video about this? So right off the bat you guys can see this has all these weird little buttons here on the side and this only has 37 keys. As you can see, this is a Hammond organ. This is known as a Hammond S6, also known as the chord organ. So these things were really popular when they came out, um, 50s and 60s, because this was something totally new. This thing could make up chords without you actually having to play them, and you could do a whole melody just in the right hand, so you could pretty much make up a whole song just on this little thing. We're going to be getting into that a little bit later, but I just want to show you guys kind of all around how it looks. We also have this cool thing that was added on later. It's for sheet music, but it lights up both top and the bottom, so you get nice lighting on the keys, and it just it's really cool. But as you can see, it's not the most intricately designed organ, but it still does have some class to it. It's very nice looking. On the back you can see the crazy fuses that they used to use. There's a power supply down there as well as the speakers. And those two things are the bass pedals. Right down there. Um, here's a little plaque it comes with. Authenticity. Made in the United States of America. Chicago, Illinois. And there's a model number. As I said before, this is the S6 Hammond chord organ. So let's take a look at this thing. So let's just go over some basics about this. We have just kind of the basics for this. So I'm going to let you guys kind of look at that. That's for the this right here, for either muting it or not. I like having it muted. I'll show you later. I have all of the instruments on, so I have organ and chords, flutes, uh, strings, sorry, flutes and strings. This is kind of how I like mine set up. I have the deep tone on, I have all the bass, tenor, and soprano on, and I have the brilliant on, which is pretty much just makes the sound more brilliant. Um, Right underneath we have volume controls which are just these knobs. This one is for the pedals. We only have two. Those are our bass pedals. I'm going to go into that a little bit later. I pretty much turn everything to up. I really like the sound of it. That's the organ. And that's a solo. So that pretty much is when you're just playing this. It makes this sound louder, this part. How you turn this instrument on is, as you can see, there's a lever down here. So we just open that like that, and then that turns it on. It takes a little bit of time for this thing to warm up. Everything has to turn on first. There we go. So how you control the volume on this, you have these for the specific, the pedal, the, um, the chords and everything, but this is the all around volume, so this is pretty much the main, and how you control that is with your knee, so that was really cool, not a lot of organs have that, I think this is like the only one that I know that has this. Um, and then, for the chords here, with my settings on, of course, you can do different settings. But if you actually just press down on this, nothing's going to happen. You have to press down on this for the chord to come on. So, let's just do that. So, there's it. 
and that is under C, as you can see. <laughs> as you can see. Okay, all right, that, that was bad. I know, guys, that was bad. Um, so it has all the chords that you're going to need in the whole keyboard. So A, B, C, D, E, F, and then G. And then we have all the sharps and the flats. And then these all correspond with these buttons here. So the main ones are all lined out, as you can see. So let's go down with C. Sorry. So that's going to be major. We also have the major plus sixth up here. Very nice sound. The ninth. Very weird sound, but it does have its place. The regular major. The minor. The seventh. Now the seventh, you know, that's still kind of used today, but here are the weird ones. Diminished and augmented. There's the augmented. There's the diminished. And then the last but not least, we have our major seventh. And then here's just kind of the what you're going to see in the in like chord charts you're going to just see it like this that's a shortened version pretty much of those and then it has it all up there too so i mean once you get the hang of playing this it's actually a pretty fun instrument to play um one other thing let's go over these bass pedals these are really cool because it just gives the whole organ a nice full sound so as i said before when you press this without this nothing happens except it allows the C bass to come up so that's pretty much playing just C and then the fifth note in the C scale so that's going to be G C and G let's do it on the G now and that's going to be D so it's pretty much just playing the first note and the fifth note on that scale for the bass so not very complex but still enough that you can make a cool little song so let me just put this here hopefully it doesn't fall now I'll play something for you so you can kind of get the idea of how this organ works if this actually stays okay so let's play uh jingle bells let's try that how that sounds now of course you can play different songs uh, whatever you want and then you have all these different controls but that's pretty much the settings that I like it at but yeah that's pretty much the overlook of this cool little organ definitely a cool find um, there's some other videos of people playing these on YouTube but I just wanted to kind of do a little review about it since I didn't really see anything out there on this really cool organ um, I've always been fascinated by organ. Um, definitely, I think it's super cool. Actually, there's one other organ I want to show you. You're probably going, wait, what? Here's another Hammond organ. Um, probably not going to do a review on this one because I really don't know how to work this. And also, it's broken, sadly. So, it doesn't really work well. Um... But as you can see, we got all the bass pedals down there. Uh, but this was a cool organ when it actually did work. I might get it refurbished, hopefully. Um, but yeah, Hammond organs, definitely very cool organs. I hope you guys liked this video, found it informative. If you like organs like me, the musical kind, <laughs> then leave a thumbs up. Like this video, share it, comment down below if you have any experience with organs, um, what you think about this certain one, if you have your own. Um, 
yeah guys and i will see you later